Hello everyone and welcome back to another Wow Body Now Abtastic Monday. So today I have for you an abs interval workout. We're going to do 10 intervals which means 10 different exercises. We're going to do 50 seconds working, 10 seconds rest and transition. I challenge you to replay this video when you get to the end of it to do a total of two rounds. Even though I'm only taking you through one round, I want you to do two rounds for a total of 20 minutes. You're really gonna get a really great burn right here in your abs and probably a couple other places on the body too. So that'll be my little bonus for you. So make sure that you have a mat, a towel or, or maybe paper plate, something your feet can slide on, and then some type of weight. I'm going to be working with a sandbag for two of the exercises today. You need added resistance. Okay? So we are actually going to start with the crab swing. So you're going to get in your crab position. Let me show you before I actually start the timer. You're going to be in your crab position, and you're going to swing your hips back. Try not to let them touch the ground and then forward. It's an awesome exercise that my friends Giuseppe and Tammy at the Suffolk Family YMCA in Suffolk, Virginia taught me. So if you're ever that way, go check out their boot camp class. It's an awesome class. And with that, let's start. All right, get in that crab position, swing your hips back and forward. As you come up, squeeze your butt, push your hips up. You can do this. Come on. Feel your abs engage the whole time. They're tight the whole time. Whew. It's been raining for the past. This is the third day. I guess it rained two days in a row. Today's been cloudy, but it hasn't rained. But it was nice. A couple days ago, I videoed our Killer Thursday workout. The sun came out, and it was so hot. So the rain and the cloudiness I've actually enjoyed. All right, we're switching it up. What we're gonna do is you're gonna go to your side and we're gonna do a side crunch. All right, here. Now try not to let your feet touch. You're bringing your knees up and in. Trying to draw your chest in towards your knees. Now, for a little extra burn in those inner thighs, keep your knees squeezed together. Ooh, you're gonna feel that. Any little extra contractions you can do is just gonna help you burn extra calories and get a little bit more toned. So let's keep those inner thighs working and engaged. Whew. Keep it up. Bring those knees up and in, up and in. Get ready to get your sandbag or your weight, whatever it is. We're going to do a swing. I want you to remember to keep your back flat and engaged. You're gonna be in a squat. It's gonna swing through your legs and then bring your arms up to shoulder level. Push your hips forward as the weight goes up. Chest stay open. Do not let your back collapse. Whew. This gets your heart rate up. This will make you feel warm. Can you see that? Some sand is escaping. Whew. Ten seconds. Hang in there with me. Push it. Go. Nice. Oh, my mat slipped on me. All right, we're gonna do a dancing crab next. So get back in that crab position. Here we go. Hand opposite foot. Keep your abs tight. Keep your hips up. I don't want it down here. Don't let your hips drop. Make those abs work. Keep those hips up. You got it. Keep going. Keep it up. Squeeze your toes. Squeeze your abs. Hips stay 
heat up. 10 more seconds. This is a very dynamic move. Really engaging all of your major muscle groups there. Nice. Okay, other side. Side crunch. Feet stay up. Bring those knees up and in. Just keep those knees together. Exhale on your way up. Hang in there with me. Come on. If you need this easier, you just drop the bottom leg and only crunch the top leg in. Do what you can. Ooh. Ooh, feel those obliques working. Shaping that waistline. Push it. Nice work. Grab your towel. We're gonna do the saw. You're gonna be in your forearm plank position. Push yourself forward and back. Body is straight, okay? Really contract those abs to keep your body straight. Come on, push it. again, or your weight, whatever it is, front lunge with the twist. So lunge in the front, twist your torso, switch sides. Keep it up. You got it. Ooh. Come on, 20 seconds, you can do this. Get low in that lunge. There you go. Get your lower body into it. Hang in there with me, come on. Nice work. All right. Stand out. Shoulder blades, shoulder and head are staying on the mat with this one. Kick it up, kick it out. Kick it up, kick it out. Work those lower abs here with this one. Woo! Fighting that pooch, especially after having two kids. I know about that pooch. Come on, kick it up, kick them out. Kick them up, kick them out. I am sweating. Come on, eight seconds. Push it. Push it. All right. One leg straight up. A little bit easier. The leg on the ground stays on the ground. Otherwise, pick it up. Reach for your ankle or your toes. If you need it a little bit easier, bend that leg, and the other leg can be on the ground. Like that. Otherwise, reach. This is going to be killer. I can feel it. Oh. oh. Reach up there. Go for those toes if you can. Reach beyond your foot if you can. 
10 seconds. Woo! Same thing, other side, and then the first round is done. Okay. Get ready. Let's go. Thursday. Bye everyone.